Hey guys, just wanted to go over a little bit about the process in making the folding knife. It's obviously something that has taken a while. And there's a lot of work in engineering that goes into it, so we're proud to announce that all four of our new folding knives are made 100% in-house. So the first step, just like our fixed blades, is water deck cutting. You can see a full sheet here. You see how close we nest all these blades together. We've got merchant standard blades and our new merchant poncho blades nested in this sheet. Now the only additional step you have to do on the water jet for a folding knife is you have to actually cut the handles as well. So this is a sheet of titanium. It's much lighter. It's a little bit thicker. So there's two titanium scales for every blade. So it's twice as long to cut. So you can see they're nested very close together. And once they're cut, they're going to go get machined. All right, step two in this process is machining the profiles of both the handles and the blades. Now these are done simultaneous to each other and after they're finished getting machined, they're gonna go two separate directions in the production process. So right now what he's doing is he's taking our handles off the water jet and they're gonna go three steps to the machine to give it all a chamfer and profile. All right, so after it's done being machined, gonna come over to the finishing department and we're gonna do the final tumble and for these this is a chasm it's gonna get sandblasted and then sprayed either teal or ruby so the final and most important part of the process is the hardware that goes into the knife and we make all of that here in house on one of our two screw machines so everything is made out of titanium what Joe is doing right now is he's making the titanium pivot screw so that final piece that it takes to assemble this after you've made all your small spacer screws, your back spacers, is that pivot pin. So you can see this just came off the machine. And it's a T8 torque screw and it's gonna fit right in that last section of the knife to assemble the blade. 